Hello, everybody. How's it going? Happy Wednesday. Well, it's once again time for Worst Game Wednesday. Hey, Israel. <laughs> Thanks for the host. Um, we are playing uh, Big Rigs. <laughs> you missed that. Big Rigs Over the Road Racing is what we're playing today, which I've heard is uh, exceptionally bad. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to make it more... Well, see, the, I think the, the record is the last week, the letter, in which we only played for like an hour. So we'll see, we'll see if I'm able to make more than an hour. <laughs> We'll see. According to Wikipedia, Big Rigs Over the Road Racing is a 2003 racing video game developed by Stellar Stone and published by Game Mill Publishing. This is an actual game you're about to see. This was published. There is a CD-ROM of this. It was pressed into CDs, just like any of the other games that I have made in the past. The player controls a semi-trailer truck and races a stationary opponent. <laughs> stationary opponent. Races a stationary opponent. So in other words, they didn't finish the AI for the other uh, racers. Wait, you have you have a twerking left shark? What the hell? <laughs> that's awesome. Hey, evil bud. <laughs> I guess that's appropriate for this game. Okay, through checkpoints on U.S. truck routes, Stellar Stone, based in California, outsourced the game's development to Ukraine. Oh, goodness. And the game was released on November 20th, 2003. Due to a multitude of bugs and lack of proper gameplay, Big Rigs was critically panned, became the worst rated game on review aggregated websites, Metacritic, and game rankings and has been frequently cited as one of the worst video games of all time. Uh, but also, the game has also attracted a cult following. <laughs> and I know for a fact that people uh, sp uh, speedrun this game. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> uh, let's see. What else can we talk about on here? Uh, there's no time limit to complete the race. The opponent does not move. <laughs> the, uh, the player's truck passes through the opponent and the objects. Yeah, there's no collision detection if with the environment at all. Uh, yeah, going off-road bears no traction penalties. Hills can be ascended and descended without affecting the truck's speed. And traversal is possible in the emptiness outside the game map. Uh, complete a race rewards the player with a trophy bearing the phrase, You're winner. Um, yeah. It has... I thought... I was looking at Metacritic and I was like, Oh, it's got an 8. It's got an 8 Metacritic. And I thought, oh, 8 out of 10? No. 8 out of 100. <laughs> so it's got... <laughs> wow. And on GameSpot, it has 1 out of 10. Why wouldn't it be 0 out of 10? Uh, oh, it says... <laughs> Uh, he, he he remarks the game only received a 1 out of 10 because it was the lowest possible score, arguing that the site should have reduced it to a 0 out of 10 specifically for this game. <laughs> uh, Alright, well there you go. Big rigs, over the road racing. I don't think we'll be able to play this for very long because... It sounds terrible. All right. Um, oh, rem oh, going in reversed. It, let's see. Reversing makes you go fast, infinitely faster. Okay. <laughs> um, as always, we can take a break from big rigs and play a game off the arcade machine like Mortal Kombat. But it does not have to be Mortal Kombat. It can be any of the games on this arcade list in chat. 
just have to pay 2,000 channel tokens, and if I beat the high score, I'll put your name on the high score list. Right. Shall we? Shall we start this thing up? Close Wikipedia. Um. I can already tell you, it's it's really bad. All right, here we go. I guess we'll just do custom race. Okay, and then we can choose. Uh, uh, oh, we can choose four different. Thunder, Mega One, Thunderbull, or Sunrise. Uh, I guess we'll just go with Thunder. Oh, and then we have, what? Devil Passage. To the, 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 very interest, the very unique name of Devil Passage 2. Forgotten Road 1. Is this Devil Passage 1? Okay, they're not consistent there. Night Ride. Oh wait, is there a Forgotten Road 2? Small Town Road. So there is, there's no Forgotten Road, there's a Forgotten Road 1, but there's not a Forgotten Road 2. Well, that seems kind of bad. All right, well, we'll just do the first one. I've noticed there's no sound yet. I hope I didn't screw that up. Uh-oh. Oh no, there, there's sound. Oh, here, let me turn it up. It sounds way too low. There we go. It's dark. So, let's see. <laughs> oh, you, you really can just go anywhere you want to. <laughs> it looked like you went through a mountain. Yeah. All right, so Israel said... If you go backwards, you go infinitely faster. All right, let's try it. What is what? This is a PC game, or was this? Yeah, this is a PC game. Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God! The sound! Oh my goodness! The speedometer is going. You should hear it. Around. It sounds like the 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 Enterprise. The speedometer is, is about to loop twice. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm surprised you don't eventually hit the edge of the oh, map. Oh, and, and then I just I just stop and it just stops. <laughs> okay, well, where am I? I'm just like off in nowhere land. <laughs> Are you in the middle okay. of the ocean? <laughs> All right, well, let's go. <laughs> I don't even know where the road is. I like how there is like, uh oh, what is that up there? Um, I like how there is like, the opponents don't race with you. It's just like you. And look at the time. The time doesn't even fit in the little widget. Hey, we found the road again. We're back in this race. Oh, look at the clipping on the road. Oh my goodness, this is terrible. As a video game developer, this really hurts my heart. Those are checkpoints. Yeah, I like how going over, like how, how was this published? Well, let's see, this truck driver stood on the side of the road and squatted, <laughs> shat it out. This is terrible. Now, granted, it is a 2003 game, but still, come on. So this is a PC game? Yeah. I mean, it should look better than Nintendo 64. Yeah, 2003. It looks like a crappy Nintendo, Nintendo 64 game. Well, when's that? When am I going to get to the end? I think that's the end. 
No, it just keep going. I just like how you can run right off the road. There is literally no penalty for going off the road. On a dark desert highway. And there's no collisions with anything. Like, here comes this little town, and I'm just going right through it. Oh, look, a tunnel. Maybe this is the end. Is this the end? Oh, this isn't like Superman where I've missed something, so therefore... That was a bridge. Not a tunnel. Are there instructions with this? <laughs> Does it end? Well, no, it has to end because you there's a you winner. You're winner. Wow. This is really bad. Press Z to drive and that's it. <laughs> I'm not even pressing Z. I'm using the arrow keys. Oh yeah, you can just drive through anything, Edgy Rose. Look here, I'm going up the side of the mountain here. Whee! And wait, hold on, wait for it. Let's go backwards. Hey, hey, Whiskey Smash! Thanks for the resub! Alright, here we go, we're gonna go backwards again. that level of vibration <laughs> I think you would die I think I think you would like your your body would come apart <laughs> oh look <laughs> we're, we're, we're vertical <laughs> this is what happens like if you go warp 10 you're in all places simultaneously yeah you've gone flat there you go Oh, no. <laughs> no, I was just stopping. <laughs> you know, sometimes when you're a big rig driver like me, you have to stop. <laughs> well, I feel like I've gone through this already. I, I must have missed the gate. Well, am I going? See, you don't even know if you're going the wrong way either. What if I start going backwards? on the race. <laughs> you think I should just restart? Alright. Uh, return. No, quit to menu. Alright, I guess we'll do this again. Uh, we'll do Mega 1 this time. Does it even matter? We'll do Devil Passage 2. Race! Here we go! This is definitely a game that you put in an R for race. <laughs> Here we go. There's my opponent. Oh, the opponent got a head start. Oh, man. Ugh, oh, the jittering is driving me crazy. <laughs> me gone. <laughs> I'm gonna try and go through all of, oh, look at the, see, right under the zero, 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 there's green and red squares. Each time I go through a gate, I think one of those scares turns green. <gasps> so all you have to do is go through all the gates. That's all you have to do is go through the That's gate. That's how they keep you on the road. And so I missed, I missed the gate earlier. But that's how I, I should have looked for which ones I missed. But what you didn't realize is you're playing some stupid game in the Olympics. Now this is, no, this is like Superman th uh, going through those rings, but much, much worse. No. Or easier. It's, it's easier because uh, you can actually see ahead of what you're looking at. <laughs> yeah. Well, and there's no penalties for going off the road. We're well, I get... mean, that's how they keep you in the, in the area of the road.
I wonder if there's those people who speed run this, if they put it into reverse. <laughs> and then just like go through the gates really fast backwards. I think it would be difficult to do that. Oh yeah, that's the thing, is it's not really I is it a game? I don't know, because there's so much not here. Who are you racing? Because, nobody. Because uh, he doesn't move. Well no, there's like nobody else. Yeah, you didn't miss much, Kai. Don't worry. All right, so here I should get your winner. Oh, well, I got all the gates. Is there one more gate? Maybe it's the end. Or did you yeah, here it is. Oh, okay. You win. It's over. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> this is so retarded. <laughs> this is really bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, let's try another one. Like I said, where did this come from? Thunderball. Like you said, where did this come from? Oh, this is oh, this is the patched version. Instead, it, it used to say you're winner. Now it says you win. <laughs> That's what they patched. That's what they patched. <laughs> Well, let's do Forgotten Road. Truck driver got out of his truck and stood on the side of the road. And yeah, this <laughs> game out. <laughs> That's right. There is a worse version of this. Oh, well, this is daytime, so let's go backwards again. Oh, see, it isn't too e too hard to go backwards. <laughs> you should hear it, Neil. Here, put on your headphones. Oh my god. Yeah, it totally sounds like Star Trek warp drive. You should hear it. What is this? This is this a road? It's It's Z fight that's called Z we call that in the biz we call that Z fighting. By the way <laughs> by the way. You've got two pieces of geometry so close it's fighting. Actually, for for a second, it sounded like the Jetsons' car. All right, here we go. All right, you ready? Oh, look, the tail lights are are floating behind it. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. It sounds like the it sounds like the Jetsons' car. <laughs> Is this a phaser on? Overload? <laughs> it totally is the Star Trek phaser on Overload. <laughs> Where are we? Oh, you've hit maximum rev. <laughs> <laughs> well, you've gone through an interdimensional portal. <laughs> Oh, I like, <laughs> like, I like how I lift my finger off and it just instantly <laughs> stops. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. There we go. Over the mountains. All right, so we haven't gotten through any of the gates. So can we just re? Can we start back up? They're like, we're gonna make this sandbox game. Back then, sandbox game, because GTA came out, it's like, we gotta make it a sandbox game where you can just do whatever you want to. Kids, they just like driving around. <laughs> well, I, I remember uh, one, of our, one of our daughters uh, <laughs> yeah. would play the Lego Super Hero game yeah. and just fly around. Just fly around. Well, she did that with Banjo and Kazooie, too. I think I missed that one. Let me let me reverse and go back. Yeah, this is like it's like they didn't finish the game. I don't see how you publish a game. <laughs> That's wait. Not, 
I don't see how you published this. Was game. this one one of the ones where it was just shrink wrapped to a card and sold for three dollars? <laughs> probably, probably. Yeah, you would see it in the little bin. Oh, look, I'm going. I'm going through the gates backwards somehow. It's in a giant uh, dump basket in Walmart. <laughs> So it doesn't matter which direction you go through the gates in. Developed by Stellar Stone and published by Game Mill Publishing. <laughs> No. Well, I know it got one out of ten. That's what we were talking oh. about. We didn't actually oh. read the Oh, review. no. There, I just went right through buildings. Oh, no. Stellar Stone, based in California, outsourced the game's development to Ukraine. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, look. <laughs> You can't even go through the bridge. You just go right through the bridge. The uh, bridge you just does sank not exist. through it? Yeah. I'm hoping I can pick up these by... Yeah, there we go. See, look, I completed it. Now we're going to turn around. Right on the top of the mountain. Well, of course. I mean, that's how you turn around in this game. And then I should win right here. So you said we should watch the review. This is so bad. <laughs> I just, I just won. Here, hold on just a second. Let me find it real quick. Uh, big rigs. Okay. Have you ever heard of the Eternity game engine? Uh, it sounds familiar. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hopefully, hopefully they don't they don't care about me playing this. Uh, let me see how. Hold on. I gotta get into studio mode. I wasn't plan planning on playing a YouTube video, so. This will this will take a second while I uh, get this set up real quick. Uh, well, you know what? I don't know if I set that up. Do, do, do. There we go. With a 1.0 patch dated November 2003, the opponent starts driving along the road, but stops before the finish line. <laughs> <laughs> I just pop this out. There I am. Oh, I remember. I see. I think I remember how to do this. Writing's not ah. that easy, but Grammarly can help. Hold on. No, we don't want an ad for Grammarly. <laughs> Why can't it go off of my account? No, no, no. Okay. Do you, 
<laughs> you weren't able to do that, sugar. <laughs> This is what we're experiencing, though. In fact, I think we just did this track. Right, it's like they didn't even try. Thanks, Midnight Fuzz, for talking about that. <laughs> Let me know about it. There's an unofficial uh, website discussion group for this called "You're a Winner." Yeah, that's what it used to say. That I got yeah. the the patched version apparently. So we're gonna go through Small Town Road now. Isn't that a, a song? Old Town Road, I think. Oh, is that is that it? Oh, it crashed. <laughs> when you see when you see just the space field behind on my screen, that means the game is gone. <laughs> All right, hold on. Let me reload it. It, it. it decided it decided that that was it. <laughs> Uh, big rigs. Oh. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, I would assume that was from, from a while ago. All right, well, let's try Small Town Road again. Let's see if it crashes again. Oh, we're like a whole. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> I muted it. We can't. We can't have it muted. Now we have a whole like trailer. I like. How have I already gotten two gates? I like how the sound. It's just a completely linear, and it has no transmission. Yeah, there's no, like, second gear. At least I don't think there is. Is there another gear? Am I not hitting the right... Oh, that's the brake. I didn't know there were brakes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least the lights glow when you brake. This is SOS. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, is there a gear shift? I'm just randomly hitting buttons now. Like G. Oh, look at this. Look at these like multiple Arc de Triomphes we're going through. Look at the moon. Let's just head towards the moon. Actually, we should head towards the moon backwards. I mean, if we're going to get there. Yeah, yeah, it's a Star Trek shirt. 
<laughs> yep, yep. These are all different starships and stuff. Are you going in reverse again? Phaser's yeah. overloading. And stop. <laughs> well, so the lights just kind of float. If you can kind of see it. Well, you can't really see it because I'm in the middle of another one. Are you going through Discovery again? Don't get Neil started. Shh. <laughs> Neil's not a, a new Trek fan. I'm, I'm so sorry. I hope your brain recovers. <laughs> I didn't think the last season was that bad. It wasn't great, but it wasn't bad. You know, I rewatched you know, one and two. When you recently. have to say, I don't think the last season was that bad. <laughs> we're still trying to. We're we're worried because they just announced Star Trek Picard season three is going to have the whole. Um, next gen cast and we're like oh no please don't mess it up <laughs> all right i'm in the middle of nowhere i don't see think i can get back to the map oh wait maybe that's it i think i see it there is no there is no there is no gear shift there is no gear shift okay all right well i see i see the map again i think i'm heading there well so far picard 2 has been a complete shit show well, it's been, the problem is, well, I don't want to ruin it if you haven't watched it. A lot of people haven't watched it yet. I don't think it's been a shit show. It's just doesn't leave, live up to them. We just want good storytelling, and it's just tough. When we're so used to Star Trek being uh, uh, episodic. Uh, what are you trying to say, Neil? Oh, that's not coming through. Whatever you're trying to do. I think oh, he's trying to trying say to, it's awful. I was trying to whisper into it. Uh. <laughs> uh, yes, I... It's we did, awful! The card one I was s sad <laughs> about. I did not like it. I just did not like the story they were trying to tell. So, I'm very much a story person and see like one of the things I don't like about the serialized Trek is that I was used to getting 26 moral morality plays a, a year and now I get one well I mean <laughs> told over 13 let, 10 to 13 episodes let me see if I can boil this down into something do I have to take my headphones off while they, they, they could they could do what they're doing and not and do it differently I, d I don't know why just just like just like i would not want to watch a television program that that portrays a compassionate and pleasant and intelligent donald trump <laughs> i do not want to watch a program that has an unintelligent daughtering and totally against character jean-luc picard yeah well, I think that's the big problem is that um, the character arcs or, or the character isn't quite uh, themselves, I guess. Did I already do this one? I don't know. They all look the same. That's what I was about to say, too. I thought I hadn't done this one. Wow, and there's express lanes on I-4. They've cut people going 70 miles an hour over the speed limit. I didn't know they had opened them. Wait, 70 miles an hour over the speed yes. limit? Wow. Yeah. Yeah. All right, this is terrible. This is a terrible game. I think that... I think that Alex Kurtzman is the worst thing that's ever happened to Star Trek. <laughs> well, with the with the possibility of maybe J.J. Abrams. Yeah. I missed the gate, so I'm trying to go backwards.
I don't know how you didn't do any hit detection with this stuff. Well, I mean, I, you know, especially in, in a time like now, do I really want to watch something that's as cold and depressing as now is? Well, that was part of the problem with Picard season one. Well, I mean, season two is not much better. Um, and the inability for them to actually use allegory. Yeah. If I wanted to be beaten over the head with concepts, I would watch Hairspray the Musical. <laughs> All right. This game is terrible. How, how long have we lasted? I don't think we've lasted very long. 40 minutes. No, 35 minutes. Maybe 30 minutes. This just isn't a game. That was hilarious. Yeah, that... I did... So there was the scene in... Um, Into Darkness where Spock says Khan and I laughed in that scene. <laughs> when Where I, when he that, yells, Khan? Yeah. Like, yeah. The Spock, yeah. it's like, oh, it's the same, but different. And they made it so that Kirk died and Spock yelled Khan, which Kirk didn't even yell Khan when Spock died. It was a different situation. So. Well, so apparently they do speed runs of this game. That is a thing. I bet you people have really, like, figured this game out because that's that's the key to speed runs is you just play the shit out of a game until you figure out all the all the ways to like break it this game isn't e isn't hard to break so it might be easy <laughs> probably be easy i mean the best yeah. thing to do with this game is to break it into small pieces <laughs> and flush it down the toilet Okay, I've, I've totally lost the track at this point. But I think this one's going to sail off into the sunset. It's a time for reverse hyperspace? Yeah, that's it. For one last, one last uh, hyperspace backwards. And then we're going we're gonna to end this. It, this is just... 100% done in a minute and 38 seconds. <laughs> Minute 22. Oh, wow. Did they do it in reverse? Actually, you, I mean, you probably can control it. It's hard to control in reverse. Yeah, and then it starts doing this if you try to turn while you're in reverse. Oh, wait. I just, I just got through a gate in reverse. I turned a, a red to a green. Oh, maybe if you go in reverse long enough. Well, if you, yeah, if you go in reverse long enough, you go into infinite dimensions and you turn into lizards and... Yep, I'm playing it. <laughs> and it's terrible. We're about to give up on this game, though. <laughs> hey, Benny. Yeah, I think we need to stop. We're making Edgy Rose dizzy. So. All right. Wow. This was bad. This really wasn't a game. At least some of the past things... Um... You were games. <laughs> it's a phaser. That was me going in reverse, Hoodie Griffith. So if you go in reverse in this game, you can go infinitely fast. So this is me going forwards. Well, see, actually, I've gotten through all the gates. I just need to get back to the starting line. So I guess there's still hope here and so that's that's normal speed but if I turn around and go in reverse I can go to ludicrous speed
Oh, you think it's just any gate? All right. <laughs> and then <laughs> you just stop going in reverse and you instantly stop. I like the way this, that's what I think is. Funny. I like the way the speedometer just con continues Con to circle going, around, <laughs> circling around, like, and around, and around, like on an old cartoon when the elevator was broken and it would just spin around and around. <laughs> around. Oh, we're back on the map. Maybe we can finish this map. Oh, we're back on the track. Oh, here's the gate. Let's see if we, we win. No, it has to be the starting line, Edgy Rose. Yeah, this game knows nothing of inertia. Oh, <laughs> I would say that uh, there are Oh, no, here we go. There are no physics in this game at all. You win! And then it goes back to the main menu. All right. <laughs> Let me set up words on the stream real quick. Because <laughs> I think that's it. I think we're done with this game. We've had our fun. We watched that review. And uh, I think we'll... Uh, we've, we've gained experience. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's it. Well, wait. Well, so... Well, where do you have... Send me a link. Uh, how can you send me a link? Again. He can whisper it to you. <laughs> oh, you're not. You can whisper it to me, and I'll put it in the feed. Well, yeah, you could. Yeah, you could whisper it to me. I, I, I could get it too. There, I got it. All right, hold on. Okay. Let me get that. Fortunately, I just. Did YouTube, so hopefully it won't give me a another thing. Hold on. Da, da, da. Hey Orlando. Oh no. We're getting an ad. I like that the big rigs is over top of it. Hold on. Okay. I don't know why there's not any sound. I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter. Oh, so he is going backwards. Oh. Oh, it's the same map, too. Oh, it doesn't have sound? Okay. Whoa, that was quick. Now, how did he do that? All right, go back. You're a winner. Okay. So he does just go backwards. Now watch the green. Okay, he got two green there. Three, four, five. Okay. Oh, wow. This would take. Wow. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, you would kind of have to know the track in reverse. What? How did he do that? A <laughs> uh, software problem. <laughs> this. <laughs> yeah, I guess so.
Wow. <laughs> this time it didn't come up. The map didn't even come up. It just said you're winner. That's it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Now let me uh, set up uh, words on stream. But there you go. That was Big Rig's over-the-road over racing, which was truly, truly outrageous. Truly, truly, truly outrageous. <laughs> All right. 2003, Lan. But 2003, yeah. All right. Let's take a break. We're going to come back with more uh, Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. We're going to pick that game back up. Maybe we'll finish it tonight. I have no idea. Uh, the game seems like it's infinitely long. <laughs> We're at 50 hours on 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 it so all right don't go anywhere we'll be right back let's play some words on stream 